Hi, this is MTS Poppet, and welcome back to Access TV. And it gives me such pleasure to be having this conversation with uh, Morgane Auger, who is the first trans woman to be on the ballot in the upcoming provincial election. She's just been nominated uh, to run in uh, Vancouver Falls Creek for the NDP. <sighs> Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, well, that's quite a feat. And, you know, it's just, I mean, it's great that you're doing that, but, you know, you've been such an activist. You've been an activist for the trans community, working both on federal and provincial levels in terms of getting trans rights, and, you know, some milestones were made and things like that, and now you can be running the upcoming provincial election against Sam Sullivan in False Creek. Yes. Uh, I did a lot of activism in schools as well. I'm. You know, I'm, I'm on leave from being the chair of the Vancouver District Parent Advisory Council. Mm -hmm. And uh, actually, that's, a, that's actually kind of a big deal because I represent 50,000 students as parents mm -hmm. in the Vancouver School Board. We were really active in what happened with, uh, with the trustees this year. You Being know. fired. Being fired, and that's a big, fired, I think, is the, is the way to consistently call it. And this is it, you know, I mean, and where does that speak for democracy? I think, you think that's going to be a biggest issue in the provincial election because, you know, um, Education, your your parent advisory, and uh, yeah, I, I think it's, you think people are upset and they're going to respond. People in Vancouver are furious about what happened. Um, you know, the the trustees were fired on the day that they had said they were going to pass the budget that mm -hmm. they were fired for not passing. Months and months after they had not passed it the first time around, so it was a total game, you know, mm -hmm. big political show, and trying to grasp at any straw possible to. Mm -hmm. uh, to hammer some sort of an authoritarian uh, uh, um, power trip. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, that said, the parents of Vancouver, we, we were not happy that the budget was being passed in the end. Mm -hmm. We were against it. It was uh, harmful. The budget was caused by you know, insufficient funding in education. Mm -hmm. And that's something that, uh, well, it's pretty simple. There's 50,000 students and the parent of one student told me they liked what was happening mm -hmm. and everybody else that I ever spoke to was profoundly against uh, the, the budget and what the, the Ministry of Education was doing to the trustees. I know you're a trans woman but you're also a mother so I mean these are some big, big issues in the provincial election around you know being a parent and all these other issues. What are some of the things that you're concerned about? Well absolutely you know so, I mean issues issues that are up that really matter to the NDP today and matter to me are uh, the child care, right? $10 a day child care is important. It's something we've committed to deliver. Mm -hmm. And I, I remember, uh, so I wasn't a single parent at the time uh, when my children needed uh, child care, mm -hmm. but it was really, really hard to get my, our hands on affordable and accessible child care in Vancouver. And uh, I really look forward to the day when we've got that in place. Now you're up against a former mayor, Sam Sullivan. Mm -hmm. What does that look like? What do you think your chances are? Well, you know, he was the mayor for one term, and then his own party refused to let him run again as mayor. So um, it's not that bad. Um, and actually, I'm looking forward to coming up against him. Uh, the last time around, the NDP was 15% short of taking over the seat and representing the people of Vancouver Falls Creek. And this time around, uh, the boundaries have changed and there's a significantly lower number of conservative uh, people in, in the constituency. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna be easier to get numbers. And on top of that, I think that I'm on par, you know, I'm, 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 I have experience advocating for the issues that matter to people in Falls Creek, which is advocating for schools, advocating for human rights, and active advocating for affordable and accessible and safe housing, which is a huge problem in our writing. And half of us are actually renters. Yeah. So people are really actually thinking about this quite a bit. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for coming to talk to us here in Access TV. Good luck, bon chance. And how can people get involved and help you in your campaign? Well, they can volunteer or they can give us money. That's the two number one, th you know, the, the, the two more, most important things. I'm also very interested in hearing what people think and what they'd like to tell us. So they can go to my website which is uh, morganoger.bcndp.ca and my first name is M-O-R-G-A-N-E last name is O-G-E-R dot bcndp.ca and uh, they can sign up for our newsletters there and also to volunteer we have a sign up sheet and then we'll get back to them immediately they can also call our constituency number which 
is on the website. So they can call and basically leave a message and someone will get back to them. Great. Thank you so much. Thank you.